If you have baseboard heat, you know how much you're spending on your electric bill every month to heat your house. The only advantage you've had is that you do have individual control over each baseboard unit. And today I'd like to introduce you to another type of zone system that is far superior and a whole lot less expensive. What I'd like to talk about today is a new kind of system called ductless splits. What you see here is an illustration of several <coughs> indoor units connected to a single outdoor unit only by refrigerant piping. This image shows how the system works. You can see the individual indoor units connected to a single outdoor unit, each unit taking care of one room or one zone. Smaller systems can be done with a single outdoor unit pictured here. As the system size increases, we increase the outdoor unit to have more than one compressor. This model shown here has two compressors. For indoor units, we have several choices. The first one shown here is a typical wall unit. Looks kind of like a baseboard unit. Can be mounted either down along the floor, or up high near the ceiling, or somewhere in between. Some manufacturers also offer a floor unit. This looks a little bit like the wall unit you're familiar with from the past. It was a gas unit. Commercial customers typically like this unit, a ceiling unit that replaces a tile in a T-bar ceiling. Homeowners could use this also if you have the room in your attic to fit the unit in. Some manufacturers even offer disguised units. This piece of artwork is actually an indoor unit moving air throughout your house. They also offer mirrors and other decorative devices for those of you that don't want to see any part of your heating system. While ductless split systems have primarily been used to replace electric baseboard systems, they're really good for any, any type of residential or commercial building. The first advantage they have is, like a baseboard unit, you have individual zone control, one thermostat for each indoor unit. A second advantage to ductless split systems is they have a high energy efficiency rating. On the air conditioning side, between 16 and 21, and also a high HSPF for the heating system, so they're very economical to operate. What this can amount to for someone with electric baseboard heating is as much as a 50% reduction in the electric cost of operating this system. This is also a savings over many other types of central heating systems as well. That's right, these units are heating and air conditioning units. They're heat pumps. So not only does the electric baseboard customer get savings on his heating, you pick up air conditioning in the summer. And lastly, thanks to the government wanting us to save energy, there are tax credits and in some cases very large rebates, particularly here in Oregon where the Energy Trust of Oregon offers quite the incentive to PG&E customers to get away from electric baseboard heating. For more information on heating, ventilating, and air conditioning, please visit our website at heatingcoolingconsultants.com. More current information is always available on facebook.com. Well, thanks very much today, and I hope this sheds some light on how you can save energy with a ductless split system.